in addition to the electric shovel that I made a base out of, uh, meet its partner in crime, the electric wheelbarrow, the Barrow Tone. Uh, both come from Travis Perkins. Uh, when I told them what I was doing after I'd made the shovel, uh, they had a bit of a laugh, then called security, and then I had to leave very quickly having bought one of these. So, in the barrow itself is a 15-inch speaker from a wedge monitor that died, um, and then a hi-fi amp, 50-watt amp, um, one side of which also died, uh, powers it. So um, there's a lot of dead electronics that have been brought back to life, albeit in a slightly haphazard fashion. So uh, the bottom of the barrow, there are some breather holes for the, uh, for the, the speaker. Um, also, there is a mains input, which is fully earthed. Uh, I don't plan on dying just yet. So, and it's quite linear across the range. Inside the barrow is a towel, an old bath towel, which just is loosely draped over the inside of the barrow, uh, just preventing any unwanted resonances. So it's quite linear across the range of notes. It's mounted on a stand. You can see that the, the disc of wood there is, was the cutout for the speaker and then a couple of other bits of wood just to steady the barrow. And then I can put that on the top of the um, barrow to cover the speaker when I'm wheeling it to the gig with the base mounted on top. So here it is, the base, the shovel and barrow combo. It's great for all sorts of music, you know, northern soil, uh, dugstep, anything really. Um, and there it is. Mm-hmm.